The Premier League have sold their domestic rights, Gab, for around $8.4 billion, which is a record. So that's, that's for the four-year period, not per year, obviously. Yeah. And so, and I've been saying this for a while, it's actually less yeah. than what they were getting 10 years ago yeah. uh, if you adjust for inflation. Um, these rights, they made a big deal out of this. Oh, look, the rights have gone up uh, by 4%. 4%, not a lot, not compared to when they used to go up by like 30%. Yeah. And also, they're including many, many more games That's right. um, in the package. So I don't, and look, the Premier League is the most successful football league in the world, by, by, by far, by orders of magnitude, better run, whatever. I don't think it's a knock on the Premier League. I'm not pointing this out that this is nothing to write home about or nothing to really yeah. celebrate. I'm pointing this out to say that I think the value of media rights has hit its ceiling. The international rights are still really, really big, and I do have a comp coming up on this, but they're also really big because, and again, they're by far the biggest and, 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 and the best in the world, but they're also really big because... There's a lot of countries that put money in. Well, also one of the biggest buyers is the biggest contracts with B in sport, where I don't think they necessarily operate as a business as much as it is as a, you know, as an exercise yeah, in BR and growth true. and whatever. And the second biggest is with Viaplay, which they have a statement up on their, which is the Scandinavian broadcaster. Yeah. They have a statement up on their uh, website saying that they're entering bankruptcy proceedings. Um, so, you know, I think all of this needs to be taken. That's very true. But I have to say this to praise the Premier League. They kind of understand that you can't rely on television the way you did on the past. And they've taken contingencies. There's three ways football clubs make money, right? They make money through television, yeah. which I think is not going to grow anymore or yeah. least <clears throat> until somebody figures something else out. Um, you make money through stadiums, and they've obviously invested heavily in stadiums. But the problem with that is it's not like you can build a 250,000-seat stadium. It's not like you can jack up yeah, yeah. ticket prices or otherwise the fans get angry. Yeah, there's a ceiling as well. And you can make money through, uh, you, you can get sponsorship and commercial income, which is fine to a point. And I think they've kind of gone down, I kind of on a rabbit hole with like, you know, crypto Bob and like, you know, weirdo bookmakers that nobody's ever heard of. I don't know how long, much longer that's going to continue. So I think all of this to me points that while still remaining super successful, the only way they're going to keep making money is if, they can control costs. And I think this harkens towards either a salary cap or or or, or something like that. I yeah. think that's the direction of travel. I think what's interesting as well is that Amazon, who currently have some of the right, not much, but they show games at uh, Christmas or Easter, this midweek this mid run was all on Amazon, won't be there in the next yeah. round. They've lost their rights. Where we see them with the zone in Italy, in France, there was clearly not, either the offer was not big enough or they didn't want to come again on the, the Premier League market. It, but it's quite interesting because in France, for example, we see the next step as we, we will deal with non-traditional television channels if right. you want. So you say like, that's back, they've had that, right? So oh, Apple will bid, Facebook yeah, will exactly. bid, Everybody, Google will yeah, bid. Yeah, exactly. But guess what, they're not. Clearly not for the Premier League. So I think for the French who are expected a lot on that, I, it's like, time I to think be rights just can't keep growing because the, 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 there's changes in the model, there's changes yeah, yeah, in how yeah, people watch sure. television, and there's piracy as well. So there's a lot of factors. That's for sure.